Hello, Etta here. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to try to get two quick videos done this morning before I start my work day. My work days have been super long lately. I've got a project going on, so I wanted to get up super early and get a couple of videos done. First one I wanted to do was I wanted to go over Arctic Kiss. Um, I just posted the video where I had done the first sniffs and I thought, you know what, it was time to change the wax in the um, TV room. So I said, you know what, I sit in there all day working. So I'm going to go ahead and do Arctic Kiss in there and get an idea of whether I like it. And on the first sniffs, I said that I smelled soap, right? Um, I, I still smell soap. It's one of those scents that... Uh, I think may maybe kind of the way people said inhale exhale that you know you either loved it or you hated it um, I almost get that feeling from this one because with inhale exhale I didn't think it was great um, it wasn't like oh I love the scent I loved the performance and the scent was was like okay for me um, what I did like about inhale exhale it like I said was the performance and it had a a decent scent and when I would put it on uh, the landing upstairs for the foyer area it does such a great job of scenting that entire area and when it scents the entire area it um, I guess it, it kind of softens a little bit it, you don't get that in your face kind of scent and so it just made the whole area smell fresh I kind of got that from Arctic Kiss um, I had it going, like I said, in the TV room yesterday, and at one point, my two youngest teenage boys came into the room to tell me something, and immediately, the youngest one was like, ooh, smells good in here, and I was like, oh, thanks, you know, and I said, new scent or whatever, and as I was sitting there working, I would take some, some sniffs in the room, and I'd think, oh, wow, that smells really good, and then a little while later, I'd be like, uh... I don't know if I like it. And then a little while later, I think, oh, yeah, there's that scent that I, that I think smells really good. And then a little while later, I'd be like, eh, don't really like it. So it was an off and on throughout the entire day for me, whether I liked it or didn't like it. Um, and I was talking to it about my husband last, with, about it to my husband last night while we were sitting on the sofa watching TV. And... He never said anything. He didn't say, oh yeah, I like it. And he didn't say, no, I don't like it. He he just kind of listened to me. And it was it was almost like in the reaction that I got from him that it was kind of like, yeah, it's all right, but I'm not crazy about it either kind of thing. Um, so I think it's gonna be possibly one of those scents that some people think they like it and some people think they don't. I'm actually anxious to try it on the landing and to see if it performs because I think it's a strong performer to see if it does as well as inhale exhale um, because if it does then I'm gonna be happy that I have what I do have um, I don't I, I can't get over the soapy smell it says um, I don't pick up unless what I'm picking up is that melon scent that every once in a while I think, ooh, that smells good. But then it will go away, and then it'll come back, and then it'll go away. Um, it says that it has amber and vanilla, and I kind of felt like maybe if it had more vanilla, a little more sweetness, and a little less of maybe the fresh air accord, I don't know. I don't know if that's where the that and the watery greens is giving me that soapy scent. But I didn't really pick up on melon, so I, I'm not sure but um, one other quick note I the other um, video that I want to do is an unboxing of some stuff that I got yesterday I had a friend who asked me to order some stuff for her and I thought okay good because I have some things I need to order too so we're supposed to meet up and she let the other friend know that we were going to be meeting up and so she contacted me and said hey um, I, I can't meet up but she says, I need some wax for Thanksgiving next week. And she's like, you know, what do you have on hand that, that I can, that I can get from you? And I said, well, you know, we were going through, she was going through the catalog and I thought, I told her, I said, you know, you don't have to necessarily go through the catalog because 
as a Sensi wax addict, I have a ton of wax and it's not necessarily all from the current stuff. So I told her, I said, let me send you a list of things that I have that I consider to be uh, Thanksgiving, fall kind of oriented and you can tell me which one you want from there. So I said, cause I kind of keep an inventory of what I have. So last night I was going through that inventory trying to look at the scents that I had to see what I would send her on the list. And to my surprise, I had no idea I had this bar. I must have picked it up in a flash sale because I know I was not buying Sensi when this was available. So, and I only have one. And it's actually one of the bars from the Bring Back My Bar. I was like, what, I have this? So I actually have pumpkin marshmallow. And I had no idea I had that. So I, all I can do right now is a first sniffs because I haven't had a chance to warm it, obviously. I mean, it's still full. I just pulled it out this morning. After I found it, I had to go look for it. Wow, that is like fresh, super fresh pumpkin. Like, like when you open up, not the kind that's, you know, pumpkin pie or whatever, but if you open up a can of just fresh pumpkin, that's what that smells like. Wow. And I do get the sweetness from, I guess, the marshmallow. But, oh my goodness, that smells like, like you opened up a can. I, you know, I tend to buy Libby's. So Libby's pumpkin. That's what it smells like to me. Oh my goodness. I think that's going to be really good. So I'm looking forward to warming that. And anyways, I just wanted to let you know that I did have that and I wanted to give you at least a, an, my first impression of what it smells like. I don't know what it's going to smell like when it warms, but um, I'm so excited that I had that. I had no idea. So anyways, Arctic Kiss, that's my review on the uh, first warming of it. And I'll let you know after I get it done, in after I warm it in the uh, landing area, how it does there. So anyways, I'm going to get ready to do the next video so that I can start my work day. So enjoy your scents, enjoy your day, and enjoy your journey. Talk to you in a couple of minutes. Bye.